Hi guys. Uh, so if you're uh, if you're trying to go into uh, the sleep mode, but uh, Windows is restarting, rebooting for installing updates, then here is the fix for this problem. Uh, first of all, what you have to do is to search parcfg.cpl. Now click on parcfg.cpl search result. Now click on choose what the power buttons do. Now click on change settings that are currently unavailable. Now uncheck this turn on fast startup if any uh, option like this is there and now click on save changes. This is the first method. The second method, uh, if this does not work, is search edit power plan in the Windows 10 search box. Just search edit power plan, click on edit power plan. Now click on change advanced power settings. Now scroll down and find sleep, double click on it to expand it. Now here you will find allow wake timers, double click on it to expand it. Now just disable it, okay. Uh, if you're using a laptop, because in my case uh, it's in a desktop, if you're using a laptop, then the setting will have uh, two options, on battery and plugged in. Uh, disable for both of them. Now click on apply and click on OK and try again and your problem will be fixed if it still do not uh, get fixed. Uh, let's move to the third method. Just search services and now uh, locate Windows update service. Okay, Double click on it. If it is not running, click on start. Now it's running. Now what you have to do is to uh, just select Windows Update and click on restart to restart the service. Okay. If it is already running, you can directly click on restart. But if it is not running, just start the service and then restart the service again. Now what you have to do is to click on start button, click on gear shaped icon and now click on update and security. Now click on Windows Update and click on Check for Updates, okay? And check if any updates are there for Windows 10. Let it get downloaded and installed on your PC. And after it gets completed, restart your computer. Now, if all these methods do not work, uh, let's move to the last method and that is search CMD in the Windows 10 search box. Right click on it, click on Run as Administrator and now you have to type this command sfc scan now okay hit enter okay this uh, will take some time uh, after that this command gets fully executed it will fix all the errors associated with uh, your system and it will fix the problem also so that's it guys please do like the video and subscribe to the channel for supporting us it's very important for us